The starter of Metarot 3, also considered an upgrade to Meta Beef. To anyone who's watched the season, the controversial season three of the anime, it is KBT 05M Psychachis with a kit of missile, rifle, Gatling, biped legs, and the leg ability of Gunman, which passively buffs the heat stat of any equipped shooting parts on the build. Definitely not deviating from the norm. Psychachis definitely maintains that conventional balance of overall speed. Um, probably not as high power as, may, say, for instance, uh, Kaiser Beetle might be, um, if or when he ever does debut, and I'm anticipating that to be sometime soon, but aside from that point, um, Psychachis definitely does not de deviate from the norm as a conventional shooter. Missile as your standard AoE gunpowder move that hits all parts at once. Rifle and Gatling as your conventional bullet-based shooting attacks with no major drawback to using them, so you can, so you can equip those pretty confidently and know that you will not be hit too hard if you got if you get caught in maybe an upswing or a cooldown phase um, when you least expect it gunman is honestly a pretty solid ability as well as it does buff the heat stat of all equipped shooting parts of the build which means that running to the line using a shooting part means that you will run just a little bit faster running to the line which will give you maybe that extra edge you need to outrun someone who may potentially cripple a build so you can snipe so you can snipe off a pot shot and maybe keep a potential uh nuke or punishment from happening on the enemy side Psychachis is also capable of meta change, where he changes his kit ever so slightly um, to missile, crossfire set, and crossfire release, uh, with changing his leg type to wheel and his leg ability to absand, which instead of passively buffing the heat stat of all equipped shooting parts, it now passively buffs all cooling. So now, whenever you're use, using a shooting based skill, now your cooldown, as in you running back to start from the center line, is now increased and running faster. Now, honestly, a pretty solid skill overall. As Wheel, it means he's going to have pretty solid mobility um, on the terrains that he's good at, even though Wheel is generally very picky. However, I would say that the ability to use Crossfire Set and Release definitely makes up for it as a high as a high spec and high power two turn nuke move if you can time it correctly. As a pure set score, I'd honestly rate him about a 7 out of 10 for his pretty solid balance. Um, with that balance, he's not going to be super fast or super powerful, but he does hit that very nice little sweet spot between all of that, where he where he makes the most of what he can do, and he does it well. As mixed parts, I would rate him equally at another 7 out of 10 for that same reason. For his arms, or his legs, or even his head, you can use him pretty conventionally just about anywhere. And if you choose to use him as a pure set, the ability to meta change and have that potential nuke move with crossfire set release least means that you, if you can cover him for him pretty solidly and give him th those two turns to prep crossfire set release, he will go absolutely nuke and decimate just about anyone in his way.